Yes, gift from the peasants. <laughs> oh, yes. Oh, hello. Well, there. There's this guy, Tongue. Look at him. He's pathetic. He's absolutely pathetic. He's four stars. There's no weapon, there's no gates. I just got him set up a dragon tiger. <clears throat> it's uh this guy, he's crazy. He's absolutely crazy. But there's two things. There's two things that are going on here. Um I've replaced S Max Ash for tongue, a four star tongue, no gates, no weapon, just he's stupidly overpowered at this point in the game. And a couple of people on the server have also gone ahead and gotten tongue. Ketsui here has him up at five star, but even at four star, I, I, the, the fight against Ketsui was really, is really ridiculous, but even um, Skillo here, he, he picked him up. A four star just being stuck in the team right um, but the most interesting thing that happened in these two arena fights that I want to show and I want to show them for two reasons the the main reason though is I noticed that late in a match my nightmare stopped working on an enemy's tongue and the tongue had activated climax super um, this this thing just in case you don't know and you haven't seen anything else this thing, Climax Super, um, basically if he starts around with less than 50% health, he goes wah, gets big, he heals himself, and he, he makes himself permanently immune to everything um, from that point forward. He, get, he, grant, he gets immunity, um, just like <clears throat> Nightmare Geese gets when he kills somebody or Magic Eye in the first round. Um, but... He, he actually cancels the Nightmare debuff from Nightmare Geese, which is the first character I've seen to do that. Because um, Nightmare Geese can't be targeted by Nightmare, but Tongue can. And there's multiple rounds um, in this fight um, with Katsui where... Um, yeah, I'm just going to start it. It's a bit of a long fight. I think it goes 11 rounds. <laughs> But you, you gotta see this. The nightmare just disappears. And on top of that, tongue is ridiculous. Um, right here, with the built-in guardian fight soul, he's he's completely shut down my nightmare geese from doing anything. It's, it's a little ridiculous. Let's see, his, his, his tongue lived there. Like, he just survived everything. But I gotta point out, my Nightmare Geese has the pupil effect on him. So he has like, I think, 20% extra damage right now. So my tongue died, but he took some good, some good damage before he died. 
And that's the other thing about Tongue right now. Even if he's up four stars, he's, his damage is capped. Like, first turn, it's 30, 30%. You know. Um, but yeah, th this becomes the Night Nike show for a few minutes. So. But yeah, it's, it's coming up here where my nightmare just starts to disappear. It's really weird. Right here, where's my nightmare? Who who got my nightmare that round? Where is it? Okay, where's the nightmare? No nightmare. And like he even goes for tongue. No crit, no nothing, because tongue, tongue's immune. His tongue's immune right now, right? Like he's healing really well, and this is the five star tongue. You know, my my tongue was only four star, but he still does the work. Yeah, still no more, no nightmare. There it is. Fine, it finally came out. <clears throat> okay, that, that's enough. That's enough. But yeah, and I thought, man, that's weird. But then um, I had this fight with Skillo, and check it out, the same, the exact same thing happens. So it, it's kind of like, you know, there's that one in five chance of whoever Nightmare is going to go on. But if Tongue's at the point where he has immunity, like he has it on him right now, it's not like he's over. But that immunity actually will block out um, Nightmare Geese's Nightmare debuff, which is the first time I've really ever seen it um, be nullified completely like that. Like it's just kind of taken off the field, like it just... It targets tongue and it just gone. So I mean, if Nightmare Geese is giving you problems, like I'm just saying, this is tongue with nothing on it. Like when when tongue gets his second gate, um, and he can just pop that heal off in the middle of a match um, when he gets low under fifty percent, and then he becomes immune right there, right there, and then it goes back up to 80% health. Um, he, he's going to become like a really, really strong, um, hard to kill fighter, even though he's a DPS. Um, he has a built-in guardian fight, stone, fight soul. Um, and, it, and it kind of only gets better um, with his S max and everything. And you know, with his along with his S Max, he gets uh, buffs to the pupils and stuff like that. Like, <clears throat> like his he almost did like a two million damage ultimate there. Like it's hitting everybody, so it's it's bloated numbers. But you know, he's he's doing okay damage even at four stars. Um, I mean, if, you know, you're on the fence about picking this guy up for your team, there's still a couple of days left. I, I really think this is one of the better fighters 
that we're going to see in the next little while. Um, until at least Oswald. Because I think, you know, Oswald will be doing something similar on, on crazy levels. But he, you know, like Skillo here, he has back row tongue, you know, and he's four star back row, but he, he hangs in there. And because he's four star, he's low life. And so if everybody else is kind of full, um, you know, nightmare geeses are going to target him. You know, and it, it really shuts down, you know, large single target alts. And he actually does do quite a fair bit of damage. I don't know, he's hitting each person for just, you know, 330k there. It's it's not a lot of damage, that's like normal tank numbers. But I, I don't really expect him to do damage at 4 stars. But honestly, like... I, I'd take this over the, the S-Max Ash I had. Yeah, this is this is just the beatdown portion. And these fights don't always go this way. I got lucky tonight with the arena. Um, I've, I lost every single match to Ketsui I, I attempted today. I got lucky with that one match with the Nightmare Geese, but it, it really, it actually brought my attention to the fact that um, Tongue's Climax Super will actually nullify Nightmare Geese's Nightmare, and it will actually target him and just nullify for a round. Um, so that that's actually a pretty cool feature of him specifically at this point in the game um, because nightmare geese has been running amok um, so you know a, a pretty strong counter to him is going to be um, a tongue you know especially when his second gate comes because if nightmare geese hits him and it doesn't kill him but drops him below 50 percent he'll just pop right back up and have immunity at that point and it'll it'll shut down most of nightmare geese's damage um, I don't know if he'll out damage him, you know, in those fights like tournament style, but um, you know, it's it's just really interesting with a built-in guardian fight soul. So, anyways, guys, um, pretty cool thing about Tongue. I, I'd recommend uh, getting him if you're uh, thinking about it still, because we got like three days left on the draw. So, good luck if you're in on it, and uh, pretty pretty overpowered fighter for the time being. See you later. Peace.